I did not expect this to go that smoothly. <sighs> I have to admit, I wouldn't have thought you'd live up to the task. Well, thanks, I guess. And as far as I can see, you're beginning to like playing this game. Oh, doch, doch. Yeah, I definitely shouldn't, I. Gentlemen, we are back in society. Let me see it. I want to see the bolt. Just wait. This thing stays in the bag until we get to Woo's place and he turns it into money. Too fucking right. You gotta take a left. It's on Shoreditch High Street. Hong Kong City restaurant. It sounds classy. What are we gonna do about this comedian? Give him to me. I'll pop. Whoa, hold on. Not here. Just keep him quiet until we get rid of this ball. Jeffrey, you're not serious. There should be some gaffer tape in the back somewhere. Look out! <laughs> Shit. Fuck. Oh, man. Unfinger. Mei Ling. Mei Ling, can you hear me? Open your eyes. Okay, there's petrol. Look, we've got to get out. Right? Fuck. We need to get away from here. Where are we going? We're going to take this bolt to Woos to finish what you started. To Mr. Woos? Yeah, well, that was the plan, wasn't it? Uh, uh, what do you want to do, Mei Ling? Do you want to stay here? Mei Ling? Come on. Look at me. Look at me. You can't not decide, okay? You have to do something. Oh, look, come the fuck on, okay? We've got to go.
Welcome to Hong Kong City. Table for two. We're, uh, we're here to see someone. Table for four. Four on me, please. It's going well. Excuse me. We, uh, we don't want to eat. No problem. Bar this way. Follow me, please. No, no, no. Make me make. We want to see the manager. You want to see the manager? We want to see the manager. You're not even eaten? No. Your health inspector? <laughs> no. Look, it's Mr. Wu here. Mr. Wu? Mr. Wu, yeah. Never heard of Mr. Wu. Well, how about the Queen, mate? You heard of her? Memory clearing. Oh, man. You listen to me. Tell Mr. Wu that Mei Ling and Jeffrey are here to see him. You tell him right now, or you can pay the consequences. Okay. You, right here. Have fortune cookie. Fortune does not come twice. Misfortune does not come alone. I didn't know any better. I say you picked that one on purpose. What does yours say? Not tell him. For me, please. Tell me. No. What's your business? Why have you brought this here? Because we had a deal. I made no such deal. I have never seen you before. Look, the man who made the deal is dead, okay? That's why we brought you your bow. My bow? Adam, turn by Asia over here. Managing to steal that ball. It's quite impressive. But choosing to steal it in the first place is nothing short of insanity. We stole this for you. I gave no such order. Not to you or anyone else. What? To steal that ball is not only madness, it is also suicide. To the Choi family, Possession of that bowl is a question of honor. They have fought wars for it. Yes. The price is beyond measure. And I know how much they paid for it tonight. And I do not intend to add my life to the bill. Now get out! What should we do with it? If the choice catch you with it, you are dead. If you destroy it, you are dead. You are dead. If you bring it back here, you are dead. You are dead. Das ist jetzt scheiße. Doesn't really answer my question now, does it? Not my problem. Atam, go on, Cordy, Tohoi. Goodbye. We will not meet again. <laughs> Fucking great.
Das ist echt beschiss. A young man may trust his ears, but a wise man trusts his heart. Did you know about the choice? How dangerous they are? <sighs> you fucking did, didn't you? You knew everything Wu just told us, and yet you still bid against them and stole their damn bowl. This doesn't really help us, does it? It was the choice that ran us off the road. We need a plan. What do you suggest? Hiding until we come up with one. I know a place. No. No, we go to the police, Mei Ling. Like we should have done in the first place. That's a terrible plan. Well, it's better than hiding away from the inevitable. Look, we need to get rid of this bowl before the choice get rid of us. If we take it to the police, they will arrest us. Not for definite, no. I'll make it an even 50%. You do realize your calculations in my gut are doing exactly the same thing? You just need the numbers to make you feel better. My numbers are based on the information that we have, yeah? And rational mathematical algorithms. Well, my gut feelings are based on experience and my entire subconscious. Do you know how many percent of your brain's activity are conscious? Probably less than one. Now that's a percentage. So trust me when I tell you that going to the police is a bad idea. Mm, okay. All right. All right, let's go. Wir müssen sie aber irgendwie loswerden, diese Schüssel. Sonst haben wir ein Problem.